Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Unit Lost. And uh, my name's Stylo, it's the good lord. <laughs> so, Titanfall is imminent. The game is about to launch. However, there is a little bit of an issue because, for some strange backwards reason, there are different launch dates in different regions. Well, I say it's a strange reason. The only reason they do this is because there's different retail. Um, I think it's to do with shipping or so. I don't bloody know. It's retarded, it's stupid. A digital game should be available worldwide at the same time. There is no reason for it not to be. It's just. It's, it's, it's terrible, it's ancient, and it pisses me off, ladies and gentlemen, because I'm sitting here in the UK, and if I want to play Titanfall, if, well, if I just want to wait for Titanfall to become available on my Origin account, I'm going to have to wait until the 14th of March, uh, excuse me, yet the game launches in Central Asia and North America tomorrow, so that would be the 11th of March, there is a three day difference, and in fact, it also launches on Russia, or in Russia, in the, on, on the same day, effectively. Obviously, there's different time zones and stuff. However, there is a way around this, ladies and gentlemen. But before I tell you about that, let me just talk a little bit about why I'm going to... I'm going to... Like, I want you to do this, guys. If you have the game, I want you to unlock it if you're in the UK. We're not waiting three days to play this game because that's just a complete joke. We're going to go and we're going to unlock this game. Now, Vince Zampella, this is the, the big head haunt show of Respawn. This is what he says. This is from his Twitter. He says, about playing early, we won't stop or ban legit copies. It's pre-launch, or it is pre-launch, so there may be interruptions in service as we prep servers. So he says they will not ban people if they play the game early with a legitimate copy, which obviously everybody should have a legitimate copy. So what that says to me is it's totally fine to use a VPN to unlock this game because I am not going to sit here and wait three days while everybody else gets to play Titanfall simply because they live in a different country to me. That is completely crazy and I just won't stand for it. So this is what I'm going to do. Well, this is what I'm going to kind of guide you guys through this. Now, what you need to do, the first step is to download a VPN client. Now, the one I use is called Soft Ether VPN Client. Now, I will put a link in the description to this. Click on that and download the client. So install the client and, and whatnot. Launch the, server, uh, the, the software, and when you've done that, select Korea, okay? Because you want to fake your location to Korea. Because you can do it for the US, but the Korean, uh, the Central Asian launch is going to be uh, a few hours before. I think it's like five hours before the American launch, although don't quote me on that, but it is the first launch. Um, so select Korea. Um, so what that does is it kind of proxies your connection through Korea. So that will get you access to Timefall as soon as the game unlocks. And then you can attempt to basically play the game. And as soon as you click that and, and the game starts loading, disconnect your VPN because you don't want to leave your VPN on because you don't want to you do not if you're in the UK you do not want to leave a VPN on because you're going to route your connection through Korea your ping will be terrible the game will be unplayable as soon as the game is effectively launched quit the connection and it will revert back to your internet line and it'll be totally fine and totally playable so then I ask the question again ladies and gentlemen why the hell did he even bother with these staggered launches because they're just in this day and age where we've got this super fast global internet infrastructure why are we having to wait for the game to be released in our region before we can play it yet um, other people are playing it, it, it it's 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 just terrible uh, and also you can use this method to preload the game the preload in the UK is not available at the moment it will be available at 5 p.m. GMT on the 10th of March so that's today if you're watching the video today um, you can wait until then or you can just do what exactly what I've told you to do and I'll put the, the instructions in the video in the description below so download the soft ether VPN client install it select the location as Korea and then just basically run Titanfall and then disconnect Oh, well, obviously you won't run Titanfall if you're going to do the preload, but Titanfall will be there. Click on preload. As soon as it starts to preload, just disconnect the VPN and it will revert back to your, your own actual internet speed and you'll download really quick. So that's it, guys. Titanfall is imminent. I'm really looking forward to the game. And I just thought I'd throw this out there just to give you guys a bit of um, a bit of a heads up on how to actually get into the game. Can't, well, I, I say early, but it's not really early because it's available in loads of other countries around the world. Um, or it will be tomorrow. So, yeah, hopefully this has been of help, guys. If you've got any other methods, then I'll leave them below in the, uh, the, the comments so people can read that. Uh, so yeah, I've been Stylosa, I'm looking forward to Titanfall, and I'll uh, catch you next time, people. Toodaloo.